The following is a selected video from yourteacher.com where you can browse over 450 complete math lessons with example videos, interactive practice problems, self-tests, and more. Try a complete lesson today at yourteacher.com. In this problem, we're given that 5x minus 4 equals 6, and we're asked to prove that x equals 2. To set up this proof, we start with a two-column chart. On the left side of the chart, we have our statements, and on the right side, we have our reasons. The very first statement in our proof will be the given statement. So on the left, we can say that statement 1 is 5x minus 4 equals 6. And the reason for this statement is that it's given. So reason 1 is given. Now to complete this proof, we simply solve the equation. Our first step in solving the equation is to add 4 to both sides. To get 5x equals 10. So statement 2 is 5x equals 10. And remember the reason that we can add the same quantity to both sides of an equation is based on the addition property of equality. So reason 2 is the addition property of equality. Since we now have 5x equals 10, our next step in solving the equation is to divide both sides of the equation by 5 to get x equals 2. So statement 3 is x equals 2. And remember the reason that we can divide by the same quantity on both sides of an equation is based on the division property of equality. So reason 3 is the division property of equality. Notice that in our statements column, we now have that x equals 2, which is what we set out to prove. So we have completed our proof. Think of this proof as just a fancy way of solving an equation, where we have to give a reason for each step along the way. 